Hey guys, John here from the Reaper blog. In this video, I'm going to show you the Playtime plugin for Reaper users. Now, this is a commercial plugin made by Helgo Boss. It is a Ableton Live style sequencer, and it only works in Reaper. So what this does is uh, it gives you a grid of cells that you can trigger clips with, and you can record clips into it and you can trigger scenes, which is everything that's laid out across horizontally. Now this is not a sampler. This is just a sequencer. It doesn't make any sound on its own. It doesn't come with any loops or anything like that. You create your own sounds, you figure out what sounds you want, and you can, you basically tell it which clips to play, clips that are already in your Reaper timeline. When you install Playtime, it comes with a track template, and it's recommended that you start with that. So right click in the empty area of your track control panel, insert track from template, and find Playtime in the list. This sets up the plugin and all the track settings that Reaper needs to make Playtime work correctly. Okay, now let's import our clips. I'm going to start with a kick and bring that into the first cell of Playtime. I'm going to right click on the cell and then fill with selected item, grab the snare and the hi-hat, the tambourine, and the shaker. Then I'm going to grab this reverse pad. Oops. I don't want to right click that, I want to right click over here. And then the bass. So when we hit play in playtime, the clips will jump to the end of the session and automatically loop. And when you hit stop, it all disappears and you're ready to start over again. Okay, so when we're happy with our arrangement, we've laid it out into scenes, we can commit this arrangement to the Reaper project. We click on the right button and then uh, we start playback by choosing a scene. All right, so I kind of messed that up. So uh, let's clear those. Of course, these are just Reaper items, so we can tweak these. Let's see. I think I want to go back to this one for one bar. Okay, so if you like the look of this plugin, you want to try it for yourself, you can head over to helgoboss.org and find the demo, and you can buy the plugin for 20 euros. Well, I hope you liked this video. Hit like if you did, share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and check out reaperblog.net for more tutorials. Thanks, guys.